The Lions Club of Antigua is committed to the ideas of humanitarian service, touching the lives of the less fortunate in the community and further afield. Speaking at the ceremony, Deputy Chairman Reginald Peterson advised the graduates that the journey has just begun. You've only just begun. It's now the secondary step. Tomorrow, it's going to be the college step. The other day, it's going to be the university step. And who knows what? As a past teacher myself, I am elated when one of my students graduate with their PhD. Now, what does a PhD mean? In its simplest terms, it's the yardstick that tells the individual how far you have reached with this thing you call education and training. Immediate past president Alliance Sabrina Benjamin gave the overview of the program. The Lions Club is definitely pleased once again this year to see the results of this program. As you may be aware, this is the second year of the educational bursary program in its current form. The club saw it fit in to continue this program and invest in the youths of our nation because there's no better investment. Both the Erlins and Golden Grove schools were chosen for a second year as a matter of continuity. The Lion, in whose honor this program was named, Lion Eustace Nant and MJF, is one of the most senior Lions in our club, and his dedication and commitment to the movement has been incredible. And we want this type of dedication and commitment to be extended to you, the students, so that you can take it into the next phase of your education. Senior Education Officer Claire Brown gave brief remarks and commended the club for the dedication and service to the island. I applaud parents whose love and support have played an essential part in bringing sons and daughters through to this point of success. Hats off to the Lions Club of Antigua. The club has remained resolute to the undertaking of assisting the youth of our nation along the road to discovering the power of their own possibilities. Two of the top 100 students in the common entrance exam, Frederick Henry and Devon Lawrence, gave appreciative remarks on behalf of the students and the vote of thanks, respectively. Teachers who contributed their service to the educational program for the students of the Golden Grove Primary and the Junior Secondary Schools were Kazel Pell, Sakari Smith, Roma Jacobs, and former principal Catherine Sweeney. The subject areas that were taught were mathematics, English language, and science. Azara Lavier for EBS News.